In 2016, Wisconsin was one of three states that gave President Trump an electoral college majority and the race for the presidency. That's part of the reason the Democrats chose Milwaukee for this year's convention. This week's Marquette University poll found that Joe Biden, with 49% support among likely voters here in the state, that's compared with 44% for President Trump. Today, Marquette released a look at the state of the race in Wisconsin this year. Let's begin by talking about how important Wisconsin was back in 2016 and how important it may be in 2020. Three of the last five presidential races in Wisconsin have been decided by just a single percentage point. So we're in a close group, uh, a group that was pivotal last time and a historically very competitive state, despite two pretty substantial wins by Barack Obama. Democratic presidential hopeful Joe Biden will not be in Milwaukee during the DNC because of the pandemic. But President Trump and Vice President Mike Pence are scheduled to be in Wisconsin next week. President Trump plans to attend a campaign event in Oshkosh on Monday. He's expected to be at the airport there at 4.30 in the afternoon. Vice President Pence is expected at Tankcraft Corporation in the village of Darien on Wednesday. Governor Tony Evers said he expects the president and the vice president to follow the statewide mask mandate while they're here.